going on, you guys? Welcome to the morning slide. Did y'all see that goddamn meme? Can we talk about, like, seriously, can we have a conversation? See, this is where I'm about to get indignant, and we about to talk about some, like, real parenting and shit right here, okay? So y'all excuse me. If y'all ain't no parents, y'all might want back about this one. To answer that question, will I allow my 13-year-old daughter to go to her best friend, who's probably her age range, around 13, to go to her baby shower? Fuck no. 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 And fucking no. I have to tell you why. Because number one, that that shit ain't cool. That shit wasn't allowed in school. And my and I'm not and, and it's no judgment on nobody else's kid if they allow their child to go out there and be pregnant at the age of 13 and had a baby. My child, no. That shit ain't happening in my house. So and all of this shit that's going on right now with the abortion laws and shit like that. Listen, let me be real clear. I was raised Catholic. You know what I'm saying? So and I know how Catholics view and a lot of people view you know abortion and things like that but I'm very much so pro-choice me personally I because of my personal beliefs I don't agree me personally with me doing it because I haven't been in a situation where I felt that it was needed for me to avoid a pregnancy however my 13 year old daughter ain't having no motherfucking baby so am I going to allow my child to go with one of her little girlfriends to be over there thinking that she's cute rubbing on the belly Ooh, I'm about them baby clothes it's so cute like no no whole ass the fuck no so if you wanna know how the fuck I feel about that you're absolutely <laughs> be clear be firm on that shit no my motherfucking child is not gonna be hanging around with your child walk around with her belly I don't give a fuck Give a fuck, cause that shit ain't cute. And my daughter, no. Be seeing all them dumbass memes and all them little articles and shit about these little middle school and these high school girls with these pregnancy packs and shit like that. Listen, I remember when I was in high school, girls used to be like, "Whatever, I'd rather have my baby now, cause when I get older, I'm trying. When I get in my mid thirties and stuff like that, I want to be single. I want to be able to run around and do whatever the fuck I want to do. My kids going to be this age, blah, blah, blah." Like, respect, and a lot of the people that I went to high school with, their kids are, like, you know what I'm saying, basically graduating high school. They grown now, you know what I'm saying? So, respect. I feel you. But at the same time, I don't, I don't think that it's a good idea for any child that fucking young, 13, 14, 15, 16, shit. I feel like it's 17, 18, like, shit, if you really shit. You damn near halfway grown then. If you want to fucking have a baby, you got to have a motherfucking baby by then, shit. Because you about to get the fuck out of my house. So, <laughs> I'm you 17, 18 years old. If your grown ass decided that you want to motherfucking be out there and be a teenage mother, guess what? You can go. If that's what you want to decide for your life, you that determined. Take your ass on right on the um, Department of Social Services or whoever the fuck y'all got in y'all neighborhood. And y'all area. Had them sign you up. You can be a product of the government forever. I'm not helping you. You won't go left. Ain't nobody listen. <laughs> listen to me. My mother was a grandmother. Okay? My mother made it clear. You take your ass out there and you go have a baby. You gonna raise that baby, beloved. It wasn't no, wasn't no sweet game over here. Wasn't no sweet game. Oh, you gonna come drop your baby off and you gonna go live your life. Keep fucking and sucking. Keep having more babies and keep dropping the babies off on grandma. That shit ain't happened in my house. My mother ain't raised me like that, and I ain't gonna raise my damn kids like that. And I damn sure am not gonna be a mother still raising my teenage child, raising another baby. Like being a whole ass mother, I'm trying to raise my 13, my teenage child, and my child is having a child. How the fuck do you even wrap your mind around how to raise your child, how to raise a fucking child? And they just, and what? And you still trying to figure out how to raise your child? What? I will not put myself through it. I will not be having my child hanging around with no bitches thinking that that shit is cute. A baby is not a fucking baby doll. <laughs> what? Are we going to the baby shop? I'm going to go buy all this. You ain't even got a whole ass job. You is not about to take my money, go and buy no little hot tail ass bitch and decide to go have no fucking baby at the age of 13 no more. You not about to take my money. You, you got a job? You got a job <laughs> to go 
burn gifts at this baby shower for this whole little child about to have a fucking baby. Did y'all think it's a fucking a baby doll? Did y'all think it's a cabbage patch baby? That child got a whole ass fucking job out here. <laughs> Was she about to spend her money on this shit? Okay. And still, I'm going to gather and collect her ass because, you know, we collect the gatherers over here. Oh, she will be collected and gathered when well, she be having a smooth ass conversation. Yeah, go ahead. I want my mama to let you go to your uh, little friend baby shop. You got your little money. You want to contribute. You want That's your friend. That's cool. But I want you to go. I want you to see all the joy and happiness now. And I'm going to give you about six months. And when you see her going through all this bullshit, I want you to remember how joyous. And I want you to remember this conversation. Mm-hmm. Okay, so when she go through all this bullshit with her mother, where her she trying to be a mother, but she can't be a mother because her mother is trying to raise her baby, and she's going through all them frustrations. I want you to remember this shit. Oh, cause I have family members that go through that shit, beloved. Okay, <laughs> okay, members, and I know of people that are teenage mothers, and they basically are overpowered by their mother with their own child. They can't even call the shots with their own child. Take their own child to the doctor. Do I know you won't leave me hanging. Their mother slams out. You ain't taking that baby nowhere. Why? Because you a whole fucking child and you're her child. And them little girls be frustrated. That's my baby. That's my baby. Not when you under your mother's house. Not when you barely working. The only thing you bringing in here is food stamps. I'm so high in here from smoking on this weed, girl. Problem. Y'all little girls, y'all be high as shit. Them niggas, them, them drinks be on me. Go on, take a shot on me. Y'all keep doing that shit. Y'all little ass little teenage girls thinking y'all grown. And half of the time, y'all be hanging around and getting fucked on by grown ass pedophile ass little niggas. And trust me, I'm speaking from experience. Because I was one of them little ass motherfucking girls when I was younger. I did. I had no idea until I was grown and realized I ain't nothing. Well, first off, I wasn't even fucking at 13. Facts. Facts. Fuck you mean. Facts. What? Facts. I wasn't out here. Doing all this grown girl, listen to me. Y'all children, y'all better go watch Disney. Y'all better watch Nick at Night. What happened to Snick? What happened to um Are You Afraid of Dark? What happened to fucking um um do a a, a double dare? Y'all don't watch a double dare? That's what I was watching. I was watching double dare. I was watching Nick and I was watching Snick. I was a Snick kid. I was watching my fucking family man as a bitch. Watch Steve Urkel. Did I do that, bitch? Did I do that, bitch? You can't undo that. I keep it simple, baby. I'ma keep you simple with your payment. Bitch, I'ma give you simple with your payment. Okay? That's what the universe wants. They gonna keep it simple with your payment. You wanna be out there, be hot in your ass. Bitch, you gonna be you gonna be fucked up trying to find some sativa. Okay? You gonna be trying to smoke some sativa, try to get your life together. It's so complicated. Why is y'all children making y'all life so complicated? I know you want me. I know you want to leave me hanging. That's what y'all going to say to y'all baby fathers. I know you want to leave me hanging. <laughs> Listen. Y'all are little kids having babies by fucking ever grown ass pedophiles or other little kids. What the fuck are you really expecting them to do? Like, I, it'd be miraculous when I actually see these little boys that actually be really, these teenage little fathers that really be being a good fathers that's because they mothers making them be i would smack whole shit out and oh 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 I, I have a son just know i would smack whole fucking shit just i mean you hear that beat don't 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 do no 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 bitch doom 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 i been Coming down on this nigga head like a drum beat. Doom, doom, doom. Ha! I done motherfucking cracked old shit out my fucking son. He coming here 13 years old telling me he got some little bitch pregnant. Bitch. 
He ain't gonna see nobody get up on their tip tip toes and and, and 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 roll to the tip, bitch. I'm gonna be hitting him with fucking arms, elbows, nigga. Bitch, I will, I'm a, I will, I will, nigga, I will house you. I will house you, bitch. I will house you, bitch. Don't make a bitch. I will motherfucking beat your ass to a drum beat out this motherfucker, bitch. I will get on my tip tip toes and march to the tip like whatever the fuck that bitch said, bitch. Fuck you mean? I wish my son or my daughter. It. Tell me I'm a big old freak. I like to talk my shit. Yeah, you gonna be talking your shit. You gonna be, you gonna be pregnant or you gonna be expecting a pregnancy and you ain't gonna have no teeth. Motherfuckers ain't gonna have no teeth now. My son tell me he got a little bitch pregnant. I can't do nothing about that. I'm just gonna pray and he gonna be responsible and I'm gonna fuck him up. I don't care. Because you're putting that responsibility on me. No, y'all too young to be having no fun. No, no, no. And I'm going to make a real, 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 fa actual, factual in my house. That shit ain't cute. I'm going to let them know. And trust me, and if I do uh, let my fucking child go to the baby shower, she ain't going to be giving them no gifts for my money. <laughs> give a fuck about it give a fuck about it she gonna go get a job and she gonna pay for her own motherfucking gifts and she gonna give to that little clucker head little dumb ass girl that just don't ruin her whole little fucking life now i'm not saying that everybody that had a teenage pregnancy ruined their life i'm not saying that teenage bitch this day and age you can't sit there and say that you don't fucking know better okay when we was younger and we was dumber and we ain't had this technology and we don't know okay Team Mom wasn't on motherfucking VH1 and shit, bitch, where we can see the aftermaths and shit. Bitch, Team Mom is on the motherfucking TV. Bitch, you know better. So I don't want to hear that shit. Bitch, you stupid. And you putting unnecessary motherfucking stress and pressure and responsibility on your fucking mother. And little bitch, I don't like you. And I don't want my fucking daughter hanging around bitches like you. I don't give a fuck about it. I don't give a fuck about it. You hold disrespectful to your mother. I don't like you, little bitch. Little bitch. Jump man, jump man, jump man. Get your motherfucking ass. You're gonna be a lobster and Celine, bitch. We not doing no chicken and chicken wings and no french fries and some mumbo sauce and some salt pepper kasha. We not doing salt pepper kasha. Anyway, I'm not gonna spend no more time on this shit. I just want y'all to know how I feel. And if y'all like how I feel, get the fuck off my page. Don't be down there in my comments saying no dumb shit because I'm gonna cuss your dumb ass out. Take direction. Ooh, okay, bye.